Physimajig is an app for Windows 8 that allows us to easily create 2D physics games and animations. Let's begin by selecting Add a New Creation. And the default tool when we enter this screen is the pencil. Let's use that to draw out a simple truck body. And notice that the objects we draw are immediately translated into a physics object which we can manipulate. Let's add a couple of tires for our truck by switching to the circle tool and we'll switch the fill color to a dark gray and let's draw those out one and two tires and if we pause the simulation we can position the objects where we want. To join these wheels to the truck body we can switch to the joint tool and if we first click in the center of the rear tire and then on the truck body that will join that wheel to the truck. We can also add joint properties such as motor speed and this will actually propel that truck forward by spinning the tire. Let's add the joint from the center of the front tire to the truck body and if we play the simulation now you can see that the truck will move forward. Let's pause the simulation and there are times when you might want to add more detail to these simple boundary shapes and to do that we can first zoom in by using the zoom pan tool and if you have a mouse you can use the mouse wheel to zoom in and to pan around or if you're on a multi-touch screen you can use pinch to zoom to get in there as close as you want. Now that we're zoomed in, let's switch to the pen tool and if we select the truck body and then select edit inside from the top menu, now whatever we draw will become part of the inside detail of this object here. So let's use the pen tool and each point we click with the pen tool will add a point to a polygon and so we can create a little window there for the truck. To zoom back out to full screen, we can use the reset view button here at the bottom left. Let's give our truck something to climb. We'll move the truck over to the side here and let's switch our fill color to a texture by selecting the textures tab up here at the top of the control. I'm going to select a grass texture and with the pen tool, I'll just click out some points here to create a little ground object and we'll drag that down and if we hit play now you can see that the truck will move across that texture object. Let's pause the simulation again and I'm just going to create a little um, rock here and I'll switch my fill color to uh, concrete and I'm going to click out a rock and let's add some interactivity so that when the truck tire hits the rock, it'll blow up. And to do that, we can go to the minigame menu and select Setup. This panel shows you the triggers, which are events that occur within your game, and the behaviors, which are things that happen because of those events. So in this case, I want to set up a collision trigger. So I'll select Trigger and we'll go to collision trigger and these are the properties for the collision trigger first we need to select the objects that will fire the collision in this case I'm going to select objects and I'll select this tire and this tire and I want to say when a specific object collides with those tires and that object will be the rock and these other settings we can ignore for now we're going to save that trigger setting and now that we have the event let's create what happens or the behavior we'll select behavior and I want to do a destroy object behavior in this case I want to destroy the object from the trigger target and let's add in an effect of fragments and let's play a sound of explode okay and we'll save that now to play our game and try it out we can select mini game play game and first we must save our creation here truck hits rock save that 
and now let's play the game and let's see what happens when the truck hits the rock all right so you can see the wheel exploded and the back wheel still going so the truck is moved forward there so that's a quick introduction to drawing with Fizzamajig and also triggers and behaviors.